Hey world, how's it going? OCRefrigeration.com here. Uh, Testo Smart Probes in full action. Uh, got 549s on here. Got my little hose set up, hooked up here. Uh, my Testo 549s on the high side. Um, I'm filming with my iPhone so I can't do the. Uh, I'll put a screenshot up so you see what the pressures are and stuff, but my 905i right here uh, and uh, about 90 degrees out here and the orange uh, wine cellar unit R22 I put this in uh, I don't know probably about nine years ago something like that so, uh, just doing maintenance on it, uh, a little low on refrigerant, adding a little refrigerant. I think it's time for a suction line on this. So, uh, anyways, just wanted to show you guys my, uh, I don't think I've done a full-on Testo Smart Probe uh, setup uh, video. So this is how you could do it. This is one way of doing it. Got the 9, so 549 on here with the 90 degree on the receiver. Uh, 905i, so it's an outdoor air temperature. <coughs> um, and we got the uh, 115i's on the liquid and the suction. So uh, got this uh, here on the suction there. And and, uh, nice blue full glass. So uh, hopefully the motor noise is not too loud and all that kind of stuff, um, or wind noise. So we'll do you test anyway. So so anyways, this is uh, pretty much done. Just uh, clean it out. It was full of shit. A little lower refrigerant running all the time. Um, but. Looks good, and uh, gonna come back and I installed the dryer. See how the put the liquid line dryer in there? Some nice plumber's tape. Uh, wrapped it around. We we'll put some uh, electrical tape or duct tape, I think, around the dryer so to secure it all down, so everything's all nice and secured. I like doing that. But rubber vibration vibration mounts. And, uh, leveled it up. So the slabs all. Kitty Wampus. So, uh, but sometime in the future we got to do a suction line. I think we got pinhole suction line. I've been here for a million years. Hey, I could put my smart probes up there. Um, maybe on that part of the pipe. It'd be cool. But I got like, uh, oh, 23, I think, degrees of uh, superheat on this thing and about uh, five or 10 degrees sub cooling and uh, everything else. So anyways, just wanna show you guys uh, one way that you can do the Tesla Smart Probes on a refrigeration unit. So, uh, yep, pretty cool. Um, all right, thanks for watching and uh, share the video. Click, click like if you could on the video and uh, share the video on your uh, Google Plus and Facebooks. Okay, or Instagrams and whatever else you got to. Okay, thanks very much and have a good day. Bye. Okay, world, uh, this is the final pressures on the suction discharge, and this is the final all put back together, all cleaned and done. Notice our 22 sticker, guys. I label my equipment. Thanks. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. And click that like, like button and uh, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. All right, guys. Have a good day. Bye.